Hey, it's Joe from Webs Online, and today we're going to disassemble your Pondmaster Proline High Drive pump. So, first thing you want to do, pull the pump out, disconnect any piping, make sure it's unplugged, obviously. Uh, first thing you want to do is locate uh, these six rubber stoppers. You're going to pop them off. Put them aside. Don't lose those. So basically, in these cavities, there are six Phillips head screws, and they're holding on uh, together, basically, these two-piece outer cage. So we'll loosen these screws. Screws will stay inside once you get it off. Just keep that upright so they won't fall out. Remove the pump from the lower cage. And now you have access to the pump itself. And from here we can actually get the rotor out. We just need to remove these four more screws. There are backing nuts. Make sure you don't lose those because they will fall out. And this kind of maintenance you should do, I would recommend maybe two or three times a year. Okay, once you get those screws out, you can gently pull off the cover, put that aside, and your rotor will actually slide out, just like that. And you can take a soft bristle brush, clean everything with uh, you know, lukewarm water. You could even use a mixture of dissolved CLR or vinegar, and then you just reassemble in the reverse order. So once you get everything cleaned and reassembled and you get the cover back on the pump, there's actually no need to put the cage back around the pump just yet. Actually, the best method for testing at this junction is basically just to submerge the pump free from tubing, uh, plug in, and test. That'll eliminate any variables that there's an obstruction on the discharge end. There are a lot of small pieces when this pump is disassembled, same with any pump rubber stoppers, screws, backing nuts, bolts, whatever. When you do take these pumps apart, make sure you take a you know, coffee mug, bowl, something that you can put these small items into. Uh, don't disassemble all this right next to the pond. If these pieces fall into your pond, you're not gonna find them, and you're gonna have a horrible Saturday. Uh, so, for more information on anything, give me a call. My name's Joe from Webs Online.